This is question 12. The College Board is asking for the line of best fit for the points on this graph. And we have four choices, two with positive slopes and two with negative slopes. Since the points go up in value as you move to the right, that's a positive slope, and we can rule out choices C and D. The question is, is it A or B? And I'm going to find the slope, the difference in y values between the first and last points, that's 26 minus 4, over the difference in x values, which is 8 minus 1. And this may be an approximation to the slope, but it should certainly be good enough to tell the difference between a slope of 3 and a slope of 0.8. So that would be 22 over 7, which is about equal to 3. So choice A. That alone is sufficient to identify the correct answer. If you look at these numbers, what they've given you is they're asking whether the 3 that I calculated here is the x coefficient or the constant. And if I put all the points into my graphing calculator under stat edit for the TI-83 or 84, I could get an approximate equation for the line of best fit, and it would be very close to choice A. And they're asking whether the slope goes with x and the intercept is a constant or the reverse. And we should know y equals mx plus b. M is the slope and it's the x coefficient. Make sure you're comfortable with lines of best fit. College Board will often ask you about them as part of your SAT. And come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.